Hello everyone, my name is Struan and I'm a scientist at Eyes on Science and today I'll be showing you a new functionality of the AFC which makes EV isolation even easier and more efficient. But first, a bit of background information in case you're new here. The Automatic Fraction Collector, or AFC, provides an element of automation to EV isolation. After mounting your QEV column onto the AFC and loading your sample, samples are separated based on the principles of size exclusion chromatography. The sample elutes from the column into separate collection tubes, allowing you to study the components of your sample that have eluted in separate fractions. Sometimes this functionality is useful. For example, you might be looking to determine when your contaminants start seeping in from your specific sample, before you go ahead and make an informed decision on the PCV you really want. Or, you might be looking to hone in and identify which fractions elicit a desired biological effect upon cell uptake, for example. However, in other contexts, you may prefer to manually pool your purified samples to enable the analysis of a single isolated volume. While manual pooling does serve a purpose, it is not ideal, as you risk introducing error and losing some of your sample. Therefore, we have made some changes to the AFC and allow you to collect a single isolated volume. Once your column is mounted, the AFC will recognize it and present the default settings for that column. These settings include the number of fractions to collect and the volume of each fraction. Now, following AFC updates 1.1.24 for the V2 and 2.5.0 for the V1, you can collect EVs in a single larger volume when working with the QEV Original or QEV1, rather than pooling the volumes yourself. Your chosen collection schedule will vary slightly, depending on whether you are using the default AFC settings or have adjusted the settings to prioritise concentration, purity or recovery. When using a QEV single, the total collection volume could fit into a single tube placed on this side of the carousel, which takes smaller tubes. For the QEV Original and QEV1, however, this may not always be the case. Depending on what you have selected, the purified collection volume, or PCV, of the QEV Original or QEV1 columns may be greater than 2 mils. Now, with improvements to the AFC, samples separated on a QEV Original and QEV1 can be collected into a single 5 mil tube. Here is a QEV1 column set to the default AFC collection schedule settings. The buffer volume is 4.7 mils, the number of fractions is set to 4, and the volume per fraction is set to 0.7 mils. When the collection volume is set to 2 mils or less, the AFC will prompt you to use the side of the carousel for 2 mil tubes. And if the collection volume is set higher than 2 mils and up to 5 mils, the AFC will prompt you to use the side of the carousel for 5 mil tubes. Now, I will change the collection settings to collect only one fraction of 2.8 mils. I will then click on Start Collection. Here you will be able to see that the AFC is recommending that I flip the AFC carousel to the 5 mil side. This therefore allows you to collect a full purified collection volume in a single collection tube, saving time and potential loss of sample from pulling fractions manually after collection. The equivalent of 7 fractions for the QEV1 can be collected in a single tube this way, and you are not limited to one 5ml tube if you need to collect multiple 5ml volumes. We hope that you enjoy this new functionality and welcome feedback on this. Please contact us at support at for more information or if you have any questions.